Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back. Brennan again. Beyond Wendler 531, cycle one, week two squats, 333 three, three plus week with joker sets and first sets last. Not as many reps as possible in this case. So jumping right into it, my first working set here is at 325. Again, going for three reps here. Again, continuing to throw you off with no socks whatsoever this time. So for this, I think I got pretty much to parallel in most cases. Looking at this though, I think I want to work on my ankle flexibility as I tend to get towards the bottom of my squat. It looks like the bottom parts of my heels are tending to go forward a little bit so set number two of 370 pounds is going right here trying to give you a different angle to see again if I'm getting parallel or not in which most cases I think I am but I probably have a little bit of room to play with as well now for this this is my fourth workout of the week so you have seen a complete week of Beyond Wendler 531. And again, this is my first cycle, week two. And again, on week two, the goal scheme here is 333 plus. Now here you see my working set, the plus set of 415. On this doing so, in my mind, I thought I wasn't going low enough whatsoever. Looking at it on tape, I would say this is just about satisfactory. Again, there's always room for improvement and you'll always hear me say that because I'm always trying to get better. I'm not satisfied with where I am and I could definitely get lower, but this is a huge improvement for me from where I've come over the past couple of years. So this one was definitely kicking my ass as most of these plus sets tend to do, but it is really a great workout. Um, I don't know what else to say. You can see my booty there, I guess, and my lack of calves, but what do you want from me? So moving on, joker set. So I bumped it up 5%, 435 pounds here. Uh, the goal here again on the joker sets is to get however many reps the week is. So since this is again week two, the scheme here is three reps. So I would aim to get three reps here. Now on week one, if you're doing a joker set, it would be five reps. Week three joker sets would be one rep. So this felt really, really heavy to me. I was exhausted by this point. This program's kind of been kicking my ass as I mentioned, but it's been very good. Next joker set of 455. Doing this in my mind, I thought this was really effing heavy and I didn't think I was gonna be able to do it whatsoever. I got the first rep, a little bit slow. The second rep actually goes up kind of smooth looking at this video and I stopped after two reps because I didn't think I could get it. But watching here on film, I think I definitely should have tried for that third rep. Uh, moving on then, finally doing first sets last. A couple of times you've seen me do as many reps as possible. I'll probably tend to do those on the bench press and overhead press days. I don't like to do as many reps as possible when dealing with squats or with deadlifts because form tends to break down a little bit and plus these, you're much more apt to get hurt if you're not doing it right. So instead, you have the options of doing as many reps as possible, doing somewhere between three to five sets, and that's up to you how many you wanna do, of five to eight reps and this would be using your very first working set weight. So again, going back to 325 here, and this weight is going to change depending on what week you're doing because the percentage of your first working set is going to differ depending on if it's you know, a five rep week, a three rep week, or a one rep week. So just doing three sets of five here, my legs were shot, it's really taken a lot out of me. As I go on and progress in this actual program, I should probably aim to get more towards five sets of higher reps, but again, we're just working towards it. I didn't show myself, myself, myself doing pull-ups, but I did that between every set for the jokers and for these first sets last, and that's my workout. Hope you guys appreciate it. In the meantime, stay big.